Jenga. <laughs> Why do you say Jenga at the end? It's the name of the game. Hi. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Welcome to Sean's first time eating. Thanks for having me. Oh, you're welcome. This is definitely my show. This is an Alley Mo pick. We were in the grocery store doing our normal grocery shopping as couples do. Mm -hmm. Some do couples don't do that. Like one person takes care of the shopping and then the other person just never goes to the store. It's backwards. Though. I will volunteer to be the person who never goes to the yeah, store. Yeah, I know you will. You try to pack as much seafood into that cart as humanly possible. I do. I really do. You treat it like a supermarket sweep game. I would only like to do seafood. <laughs> What'd you find? I found these little crab soft pretzels. Allie's three favorite things in the world, cheese, seafood, and pretzels. Yeah, he's not wrong. <laughs> and then Lionel fourth, me fifth. No, yoga fifth, new yoga clothes six, me okay. seven. Okay, stop it. Very excited, we just got back from the west coast, had a bunch of fun seafood there. Yeah. I love crab, uh, and these actually have, it makes a point of saying it's real crab, it's not imitation crab. Yeah, poop is on the box. Not gonna lie, I'm a little disappointed already from the start. Me too, they look awful. Yeah, this looks <laughs> Delicious. They look so good on the box and so awful here. Yeah, it's just like <laughs> It looks just not good and it's really hard like I so these are supposed to be in the oven at 350 for 28 to 30 minutes So I did 28 to 30 minutes at that temperature and I'm just not feeling great about this I'm You can't even can I like break it? Yeah, let's go for it. I'm just gonna bite right into it. Yeah, it feels too hard. Ooh, okay. I'm, I'm worried. Okay, there's a lot of steam. Okay. Can, see, can you see steam? Yeah, Ooh. oh yeah, there we and, go. I mean, I can see the steam, but I don't know if the camera can see the steam. Never misjudge people's eyes. They can see for miles. When Jamie smiles, it takes me miles. The crab and the cheese on top is delightful. The pretzel is abysmal. Like, I'm gonna scrape that off and put it on toast. Yeah. Damn, I mean, like. Yeah. It recommended to cook it from frozen. I couldn't have followed the box more to a T than it said. It's, like, it's stale almost. It tastes stale. I'm sorry. I'm so excited. <laughs> well, I've never had a crab soft pretzel. Sometimes it's fun in this situation because you can only go up. Like, I'm sure they serve these on the East Coast somewhere as an appetizer at like a bar menu, and I bet it's so fire. I'm not gonna lie, that middle piece of dough felt raw. Cool, we're gonna die. I mean, I don't think so, but. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't know. Have you ever known anybody with crabs? Okay, so let's talk a little bit about crabs. Can I have a trash can? <laughs> can I have the trash can? Gross. I was way too close to that. You know, I'd take the I L if I had cooked it wrong, but I didn't. So in summary, don't buy these. Like, I want to save the crab and the cheese. I know, maybe that's the move. Like, do we have crackers? We actually do, we have crackers from um, Eric and Megan up there. Great idea, babe. Electric Eric Ely coming through with a uh, Christmas gift of cheese and crackers. He's gonna save this. Yeah, removed from the pretzel. That is a good crab dip. You just saved this video though, like, as an idea. I wouldn't have thought of that, of like just doing, look at that, I'm gonna make a sandwich. There you go, that's a little bit better. Made myself a cracker sandwich. Oh, that's delightful. Yeah, like the crab dip portion of it, mm -hmm. really good. And it's nice that the cheese is like a little bubbly. Hey, Phillips, just make crab. You probably surround yourself with people that are like yes men. They're telling you how great you're doing everything. Oh my God, you started this frozen food company and you're just doing so great. We're so proud of you. You need somebody like us to tell you the pretzel sucks. The crab and cheese, delightful. The pretzel sucks. Imagine like doing this at a party, somebody walking into like the snack table and then being like, what are you doing? Like, I didn't like the pretzel, so I made my own dip. Yeah. So how's your week going? What have you been up to? Yoga. Activate through your core, rotate through your spine. Keep whatever bend in your knee you need. I'm gonna do one more bite with a cracker, with truff. I actually think I would like to join you if that's okay. It sounded really good, a little truffle flavor on this. Hey, uh, nice suggestion in the grocery store. <laughs> Yeah, I'm really sorry about this one. I should have gone for the guava cookie. <laughs> you totally ruined this. I know. I'm kidding. You're beautiful and amazing. You are beautiful and never see. Yes, no, thank you. Words. Bring the, the truff bite. Have fun. He's always trying to murder me with hot sauce. It's so damn good. They made truffles taste better than truffles. I agree. That's very weird. Effing fantastic. Yeah, this is very good. 
And another thing, the pretzels only come one per box. Yeah, one in a box is so stupid. I wonder if Philips is like a seafood brand that like tried to do a seafood pretzel or if they're like a pretzel brand that was trying to do a crab flavored pretzel. I think it's the screwdriver guy just got sick of doing hardware and pivoted. I'm gonna go with their seafood company. <laughs> Isn't Phillips also a light bulb? Anyway, so what else are you gonna put in this video to make it more interesting? <laughs> you just watch us be really sad. <laughs> Don't you bring me down. <laughs> you're somehow cuter when you're sad. <laughs> Guys, have you ever had anything from the Phillips brand? Is there a seafood item in the frozen food section that you hang your hat on? Something that we should look for. We obviously like to get it fresh, but sometimes you're in the mood for seafood, you know, that you just want to throw in the oven. What do you got? Our favorite thing we've had, coconut shrimp. I know, that's what I was gonna say. Oh, there's I this coconut shrimp. That in the we freezer. can show that in a future episode. It doesn't have to be a first time meeting. We can just show Allie and Sean's favorite frozen redemption. food. We need a redemption. A redemption item. story. It's a coconut shrimp that we buy from a like meat manufacturer that just happens to have a frozen food aisle as well. Yeah. So we'll show those sometimes. But drop a comment below if you've got a good seafood from your grocery store that you get that's not fresh, like a frozen item. A frozen seafood item. I buy a bag of frozen shrimps. Yeah, maybe there's a brand of shrimps that they really like. Eleanor Shellstrop. Ah! <laughs> this is the dream. It is? Yeah. What is it, the shrimp cocktail sauce that comes out of the- No, the sh there's shrimp and there's shrimp cocktail that yeah. come out of the- Nobody try mystery flavor. It's white chocolate and it is nasty. Well, this was Sean's first time eating crab pretzels. Hoping the next time I have it, it's in Maryland because I'm thoroughly disappointed. Crab cakes and football. Nice. That's what Maryland does. Hey, <sighs> Cheers to trying new things and saving you all from making our mistakes. <laughs> Started positive, wow. got real sad. I just bit the inside of my cheek. <laughs>